Pretty much anyone traveling through Arvada sees it every day. The massive amount of work going into building the Gold Line commuter rail system scheduled to open in 2016. But in quieter spaces, mines are at work on other aspects of the Gold Line. The city very purposely wanted to create some enhancements to the Gold Line station stops so that they wouldn't just be sort of generic train stations. It's settled on the idea of interpretive panels that will be part of each of the three stations in Arvada. Citizen input was key. We established a citizens committee and we had a couple public meetings here at the McAvoy House that were well attended. And in early 2014, the firm Conservation by Design out of New Mexico was chosen to carry out the project with interpretive planner and exhibit designer Melanie Pearson leading the way. While I was here back in April, I spent some time just sort of observing Arvada and the architectural character of the town and visiting here at the Historical Society and checking out the, the photo archives. Pearson helped develop goals for the interpretive panels, things like creating opportunities for civic pride and inspiring visitors to spend more time in Arvada to learn about its history. From that process, with Melanie's help, we developed the thematic concepts and began researching the history and looking for ways to illustrate the panels. A central theme emerged, sparked by gold and sustained by agriculture and rapid post-war housing development, the historic city of Arvada is a vibrant community with a small town feel and big city ties. Its charming downtown and friendly faces remind you of a simpler time when the pace of life was slower and neighbors were dependent on each other. From that, unique sub-themes developed for each of the three stations. The Sheridan station will focus more on the gold strike. The Old Town station will focus more on transit, transportation, and commerce. And then the Arvada Ridge site will focus more on the post-war period and rapid suburban expansion, the Rocky Flats, the Ridge Home site, and so on. The Old Town station is considered the flagship station for the interpretive panels. So our concept for the Old Town Plaza is a series of steel columns and they'd be freestanding steel columns that would have a nice patina and on one side would be the graphic panels and on the other side what we're proposing to do is to basically take inspiration from a historic photo of the area. I think one really interesting part of the story too is the whole story of the arrival of the train and the streetcars and, and now we've got the gold line coming and sort of the idea of what goes around comes around. With 90% of the planning process complete, the focus for 2015 is fabrication and installation, hopefully by year's end. With the future of light rail aimed full speed ahead toward Arvada, it's hoped the interpretive panels will be a great way to reflect on our heritage. I think Arvada's got both a small town and a big city ambience, and it's a great way to introduce people to Old Town and how we got to where we are.